What is happening guys? Welcome back to my Horizon Forbidden West walkthrough. So, we are currently on the main quest called Pharaoh's Tomb. So, we are exactly right where we left off from the previous episode. We're currently all the way over here to the west on the map. We are about to go and find the entrance to Thebes. Or Thebes. I'm not sure how to pronounce it. I forgot, but yeah, here we go. Um, okay, it's not up. That means we must go down. Underwater. Alright. So for you guys who are just tuning in, I will leave a link down in the description. If you guys are interested in checking out the previous episode, or perhaps the beginning of this series, a full playlist down below. Check it out. So, uh, I'm not sure how much we have left of uh, of this game. Not really. Uh, but we have... Restored Gaia. So we have officially entered, you know, the last couple of missions of the game, pretty much. Let's see, uh, yeah, this way. Oh, here we go. Oh, come on. This is not going to get easier, is it? Oh, we actually have to wait for it to stop. Well, this is too late, isn't it? Yep. Come on. There we go. Ah, okay. Alright, making progress. There's gotta be a way to stop that turbine around here somewhere. Okay, I think that door is open. Yeah. Oh no. Oh, we just turned off this. All right. Come on. Now you're just being annoying. Come on, Aloy. Thank you. Oh, here we go. Now, let's see if we can open up, well, find a way back and open up for the rest of the group. Just, might as well explore a little, you know, see if we can find any data or chests. Anything? Yeah. Now we're talking. I do need materials, crafting materials. I haven't really farmed in a while, so... Yeah. I'm grateful <laughs> for any type of chests, really. <laughs> There's another one. Ah, there we go. Perfect. Now, before we go through there, might as well take a look at every single door here. 
Uh, well, we'll look over here. Another data point. Thank you very much. Anything? Yeah. There we go. Alright then, let's continue. Yeah, this is the just another way around, is it? Yeah. Okay. Look at this place. Okay. It's pretty fancy for this apartment. Things are starting to make sense. That's the door. Before we open that, might as well take a look at that. And there's another chest. Yes, perfect. Okay, I think that's it. Well, we do have herbs, but um, we're good. I have plenty of herbs. All right then, let's open up the door. And see what's next. Ah, good. An emergency exit function. Emergency exit. The door is open. Destiny is upon us. I knew you could do it. What's going on? The CO is preparing to enter Thebes. Oh, why are you dressed like Ted Pharaoh? I am Pharaoh, renewed. My essence is the same as his. Across the years, across the generations, his soul is my soul. His will is my will. We are sundered in only one way. I need his final testament, his deepest secrets. And now that the door is open, those secrets are within my grasp. When I have them, I will be complete as he was. I will have everything I need to save our homeland, and, as Pharaoh did, the world. Okay. I think there's some confusion here about who Pharaoh really was. No one knows better than I who he was, who he is. Me. The Renewer, greatest of the ancestors, the man who saved the world, and you. You understand, Sobek. You are her, Pharaoh's harbinger, his assistant. Come, we will descend into Thebes together, as it should be. Bring her the raiment. Raiment? As he is Pharaoh, you are Sobek. For an occasion, this momentous, shouldn't you wear proper business attire? Whoa. <laughs> no, 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 no. No, I am not wearing that. No way. You will wear the proper attire to mark this moment. Or what? It is said Sobek valued life above all else. Is this true? Fine. I'll wear your raiment. Okay, this CEO fella is really 
starting to piss me off. Who the hell does he think he is? Simply breathtaking. Excellent. Somewhere in here. Making us wear this awful looking uh, <laughs> outfit. Alright, through here. Okay, this kind of looks like a, you know, a battlefield. Like a battle is coming up or something. Great risks bring great bounties overseas. Don't really need to follow me, come on. Just wait until I find a way and then we can go. Excellent. Remember every detail of his bohai for posterity. Yeah, down here. Doesn't really matter which way we take, I guess. Well, I did not want to miss this, so perfect. Another data point. There will be no further discussion of your feet, Bohai. Is there anything on this side? Doesn't seem like it. No. Okay. Let's enter that room. So hey, this is weird. I tried to warn you. Yeah, sort of. I'll explain everything if we survive long enough. Those certainly look threatening. Ah, statues. The guardians of Pharaoh's domain. Those aren't statues. Look out! Get the CO out of here! This is just us, then. Okay, why the hell do I recognize these? Oh yeah, Corruptors. These are from uh, Zero Dawn. Well, they were in Zero Dawn. It's a good thing that we scanned these since... Uh, I'm not sure if they'll, you know... They are in the wild as well. And you do want to get every single, you know, scan on every single enemy there is in the game. That's a trophy. Keep that in mind. But yeah, who knew the CEO is a coward? Oh man. Le leaving us to do the dirty work. Of course. Not surprised. But yeah, these uh, corruptors were easy. I mean, I... Do remember them being a gigantic pain back in Zero Dawn, if I'm not mistaken. He has decided to return to the surface. Yeah. We can't afford to lose any more diviners than necessary. At least that's what I remember. So, no more delays. We must proceed. Okay. Ah, oh, you're back. Oh my god. Okay. Being annoying as always, I see. Yes, Through here, then. That looks like the way. Oh, let me just grab this chest. Gold ingot. We, we have a lot of things we can sell now as well. Ever deeper we go. Lining throne attached to some kind of apparatus. I wonder what it does. And I really setup. hope that this guy doesn't make it somehow. I don't know. I would hate to see him make it out alive, to be honest. <laughs> he is so annoying. I 
thinks that he is the ancestor of, well, this pharaoh fella. Uh, um scan the device scan the device okay ah oh, all right made a minor adjustment to the gene therapy regimen and added a new cocktail to treat the symptoms caused by the mutations hopefully there will be some stabilization after the next treatment God knows what Ted will do to us if there isn't. The early results were so promising. No signs of aging, no cellular degeneration, but now... Oh, if only I had access to my old lab in Bangkok, or my old colleagues, or my old liquor cabinet. Stop it. Got to stay positive. For Kenya. All right. Anything else? I saw something. Ah. I could tell. Did the data explain what Pharaoh used this device for? I think he was undergoing treatments to live longer. A lot longer. Really? Could he still be alive? Don't be foolish. If he were alive, he would have kept his essence. It would not have been passed down to me. Remember, he was the renewer. Of course, he would have stopped at nothing to grasp the secrets of life and death. But not for himself. Everything he did was for a new beginning. For us, for the Quen. And for his true heir, me. You know, I'm starting to think you're right. You do have a lot in common with Ted Farrow. I knew you would see, in time. Let us continue. His secrets await. Okay, what I think that Aloy meant by that is that they both are insane. Ted Farrow and CEO. That's the only thing they have in common. Hmm. Is that a small office? For a minor functionary, perhaps? Alright, open up. This really is one deep tomb. Well, facility. Alright. Here we go. Let's open this up. Look at all this equipment. We are getting closer to the heart of this place. I can feel it. Okay, I think we need to find another way in. Yeah. By the way, make sure to leave a like on this video, subscribe, turn on those notifications by hitting that bell icon so that you get notified each time I upload a new Horizon Forbidden West video. Or anything else for that matter. So yeah, um, ah, here we go. Okay, there's another way in. Perfect. Not a vent of some sort. Not a bad idea. Hurry! Break it open. I have a bad feeling. Maybe not. Okay. Uh, recover Ted Faro's Omega Clarence. There we go, a lot... Okay, you know what? We're getting a lot of um, crafting materials. Something could happen here. Yeah. Ted. 
Sometimes dead. Along with his kid. Found him on the floor of his office this morning, holding hands. Must have poisoned themselves. I never would have put them to sleep. She was just a girl, for Christ's sake. I offered them life. And this is how they repaid me. By leaving me all alone. But I guess I've been alone since this whole thing began. Alone in bearing the burden. For the past. For the future. Same old Ted. No matter who dies, he's the one feeling sorry for himself. Bless his future. Bless his children. Someday they'll come. And I'll be here to greet them. Sometimes that my aging has stopped altogether. If anything, my cells are replenishing faster than normal. I just need some time for the mutations to calm down. Time. And energy. Sometimes that the reactor can give me what I need. To grow strong again. To get my shit back together. So I can greet the kids. They're gonna need me. My advice. My guidance. And then I won't be alone anymore. Pharaoh's secrets. Are they here? Uh, not the ones you're looking for. Then they must be in there. Trust me. You don't want to go in there. Are you mad? I haven't come all this way to stop now. Legacy is mine. to melt down if kill them too no witnesses oh my god really now i knew it i knew that this guy was going to somehow piss me off even more again i really hope that we get our hands on him or that he somehow doesn't make it Why are they fighting each other? Oh, hold on. Some of them are actually protecting Alba by the looks of it. That's the only thing that makes sense. Why would the hell would they otherwise fight each other? That's weird. Okay. Uh, yeah, let's... I think we'll just go. I mean, this place is done for. We can't go in there and see how Ted Farrell looked like. So, yeah. Oh, there's lava coming. Oh, my God. Keep moving, okay? Why the hell you would want to fight me here? Just leave. You're going to die, man. This is what happens when you f follow a moron blindly. This is exactly what happens. <laughs> oh, man. They're wasting their lives. All right. Oh, 
Open up, come on. Well, that was karma for ya, CEO. I'm really happy to see that that actually happened. Uh, Alright, how are we supposed to leave this area? I mean, I don't see a way out. Oh my god. Um, it's not that way, is it? Oh, never mind. Here we go. Let's go. More? Really? The leader is crushed. Stop stopping us from leaving, man. Give me that. area is shaking like hell. It's kind of hard to aim. <laughs> Alright. Oh, here we go. There's the exit. something that will help not just your homeland but everywhere but where's the CEO oh, he's gone I guess you could say he gave his life to help us attain the secrets of Thebes I see You must think I'm eminently stupid. What? No. No. The CEO was an entitled egotist who twisted our beliefs into a sickening, self-serving fantasy. And you expect me to believe he sacrificed himself for scraps of data? It's time for the truth, and it better be convincing. Otherwise, I'll simply order these soldiers to open fire. Hold on. You're right. To be honest, the CO screwed everything up. He brought Thebes down around our ears and died like a gutless coward. But we really did find something down there that will help your homeland. If I can take it and use it. Now, if I have to, I will fight my way out of here, but it doesn't have to be that way. You can just let me go. And then take credit when things start to improve.
Success certainly does sound better than failure. It seems then that our destinies are intertwined. Landfall is open to you. If it will help your cause, you may come and go as you please. But Alva must join you and report back on your efforts. Fair enough. Thebes is of no further value to us. Obviously, we're going back to the flotilla. Alva, I expect your reports to be thorough. Oh, I thought he was going to have us killed. Oh, and instead, I get to join you. Glad to have you. But you're going to need a little help to reach our base. Varl, I made a new friend. I need you to meet her at the Quen Ferry and escort her back. On it. Can't wait to meet her. Trust me, you'll love it there. Varl will give you a better focus and all the data you could ever want. Head to the ferry. I'll join you back east as soon as I can. A diviner must follow the truth wherever it leads. I'll see you there. Okay, completed main quest, Faro's Tomb. Nice. That's nice. Uh, before we wrap things up, might as well... Well, start the next one. Gemini. So, what's next? Return to the base. Okay, I guess we'll fast travel back. I hope we can, since we are on a different island now. Um... Shouldn't be problem, really. Nah, nice. So the base is back all the way over here. And travel, come on. I'm just... Yeah. Okay. Oh yeah, before we do anything else, let me just re-equip everything. Here's our armor, or a Thunder Warrior. I still haven't managed to, uh, well, upgrade it. Snow falling. <laughs> so I'm guessing that we actually need to go and talk to Gaia now. Yeah, okay. Welcome back. Aloy. I know your experience in Thebes was unsettling, but we have a new problem. Did something go wrong with Beta and the rig? Will we be able to transport you to Gemini? The rig is complete. The problem is Hephaestus itself. It has accelerated its proliferation throughout the Cauldron Network, increasing its power. But with your sub-functions restored, we can still succeed, right? Correct. But the net effect is that absorbing Hephaestus will take longer than previously calculated. How long? Even with Omega Clearance, my current estimate is that the merge will take 35 hours. And each hour increases the risk of detection by the Zeniths. Two cores. Two overrides. What if the merge were carried out by two clones of Elizabeth Sobek, both armed with Omega Clearance? How long then? Half the time? Hephaestus would be unprepared for the simultaneous labor of two operators, in addition to obvious synergetic efficiencies. Calculating. It would reduce the merge time to approximately 4.5 hours. Okay. Varl, it looks like we're gonna need Beta at Gemini. Do you think you can convince her? Uh, I don't know, but I'll try. What about our diversion? Are the pulse generators ready? Only a final test remains. I am confident that if fired in proximity to other cauldrons, 
The pulses will mask our activities at Gemini from the Zenith. Good. As long as Aaron can operate one without shooting himself in the face. Aloy, you better get down here. Beta's in bad shape. Okay. Okay, I guess we'll go and check on Beta. And see how she's doing. Oh yeah, down here. Aloy. I tried, but it's impossible. I don't think anything will convince her to go. We don't have a choice. Good luck. Beta, you have to come with us. It's the only way. It's one mission. The most important one. We need you. Tell me why you won't go. What if they... What if they take me back? Alone. In a cell again. A slave. Forever. Laurel and I will be at Gemini too. I'll protect you. As soon as we get Hephaestus, we'll come straight back here. The Zeniths aren't going to find us. You don't have to be afraid. No! You can't protect me! Nothing can protect me from them! I told you from the beginning, we'll never beat them! It's hopeless! You don't understand! You're right. I don't understand. We have the same genes, the same mind, the same heart. So why can't you find the strength to do what has to be done? Like Elizabeth would. Don't you think I've thought about that? I don't know what piece of Elizabeth I'm missing. I don't know what you have that I don't. I looked through all the data from your focus. You were raised as an outcast, shunned, and isolated just like me, so what's the difference? What's my defect? He raised you, trained you, but he was never warm or loving. The day he died, the day he gave you that charm, he was going to abandon you. He wanted me to embrace the tribe. But then he gave his life for mine. He loved me in his own way. And that was enough. What did he feel like? It was like having a strength that was always there. It's still there. Even now I hear him in my head when things get bad. But it looks impossible. Look deeper. And then fight like you can win. You don't have to go on a mission. We'll find another way. I'll go. 
You said you'd try to protect me. I believe you. But you have to promise me one thing. Yes, of course. If it goes bad, if the Zeniths find us, I don't want to be their slave again. Do you understand? Okay. Promise? I promise. I could use as much time as you can give me to study up on the merge, to make it as efficient as possible. I'll be ready when you are. I swear. Well, I'm really glad that we got to, you know, help her out and talk some sense into her. Um, let's see. Our next step is to talk to Gaia again. But yeah, you know what? I think this could be a great time to wrap things up right here since we, this is already a long episode uh yeah so thank you so much for watching i really hope that you guys enjoyed let me know down in the comments on what you guys think about this series so far and i'll see you guys in the next video all right take care peace bye